But first, I want to talk about those unruly crowds that caused problems downtown this weekend. There were also dozens of shootings. Eight people were killed, and the violence comes as the weather warms up. One Chicago alderman says we need more security resources going into summer. Stephanie Wade is live at police headquarters with an update this morning, Stephanie. Yeah, we're hoping to hear more from police today. This was the warmest weekend so far this year. And according to police, 42 people were shot, eight of those fatally between 6 p.m. Friday evening and 11.59 Sunday night. Of the 42 people shot across Chicago this weekend, their ages range from 16 to 65. And while the shootings happened in different parts of town in River North, where there's been a lot of concern about crime recently, a man in his 20s was among those critically wounded following an incident on West Hubbard Street around 10 p.m. Saturday. The number of illegal weapons on the street has never been higher. Um, and when you combine that with alcohol, with fighting and conflict, um, you have all the all the ingredients there um, for a, a violent weekend. <laughs> It was also a chaotic scene in the loop where large groups of teens were gathering near Millennium Park. At one point, several people jumping onto a cab. They're seeing larger crowds of juveniles than, that they can handle. Uh, we had at least 400, uh, by some estimates, during the peak moment of mayhem, it was over 400. We just didn't have enough officers to contain uh, the violence. Ten people were arrested, eight of them juveniles. Alderman Brian Hopkins says we need to crack down on crime ahead of summer and have more officers on the street. We've been talking about this for two months. We knew the warm weather was coming, and so there was no shock in terms of what happened. Uh, it was just a, a lack of resources. Now, in a statement released by Chicago police over the weekend, officials say they, quote, anticipated the large gathering and had sufficient resources deployed to manage the crowd and ensure public safety. Terrell, back to you. Stephanie Wade at police headquarters. Stephanie, thank you so much. There were a pair of crashes.